How's Nanako-chan? Where is she? Fast asleep. Hey, did you know Miss Kashiwagi and Hanako-san were staying in the room next to ours? Could have helped if we knew that before. Those two seem to get along really well. I'm, I'm surprised. They come and stay here now and again. Usually they come to cry when something breaks their heart. Ah, uh -huh. I guess they were really devastated from losing to Naoto-kun. Please don't bring that up again. <laughs> well, they do make a good team. The night of the Maggie Inn passes by. That was shit, man! Uh, you came back from the Maggie Inn. You have the day off today because of the cultural festival. Got any clues? All you have to do is wait. Uh, I'm gonna go hang out with Death Lady. Yes. That was ridiculous. That was mean. It's like, seriously, guys? Seriously. Wait, why did I go to this shop? Whatever. Uh, Death Lady! Well, that was like a horrible experience. <laughs> seriously, that was so horrible. First the beauty pageant shenanigans, then we get to relax at Amagi's at Yukiko's Inn, and we just get tortured the entire time. It's like, damn it. Ah, whatever. What's past is past. My. Happy to see you. Right. Yes. I'd be happy to. I'm happy we could meet again. Why do you keep coming back? It must be boring listening to old bag stories. It's actually interesting. <laughs> well, you're just a special boy, aren't you? Enough about me. I want to hear something from you. Tell me anything. Um... School? That's so. You must be brilliant in your classes. I'm starting to think you shouldn't be wasting your time talking to an old lady like me. I wish I could listen to your stories forever and ever. Oh, that's sweet. I. God, she's short. Level 5. Halfway there! But, but I don't want I to do not want to see you anymore. Why? But I want to see you. Yeah, why not? Why not? I'm sorry. You just remind him, me of him too much. Well, too bad. Thank you for everything. You know what? Too bad. Goodbye. Well, geez. Thanks, lady. Alrighty, today is Monday. Oh, hey. It's cold today. Oh, it is. It is Halloween. Now for our next story. Mr. Kozai of the Environmental Concern Society visited a local elementary school to investigate the effects of the fog. Oh, boy. Thick fog has appeared frequently in Inaba over the past few years, and the cause of it has yet to be determined. So this has been happening for a while. 
There's been much conjecture on the origin of this fog, and some are concerned about its effects on the human body. What do you mean? Town officials believe it highly unlikely that the fog could be harmful. <laughs> if only they knew. One official suggested that the concern is largely tied to public anxiety in response to the recent murders. On hearing about the phenomenon, Mr. Kozai visited the local elementary school to investigate its effects. He interviewed the children playing happily in the fog about their health and any anxieties they were facing. Oh, that man came to my school. Do not tell me you ended up on the television, Nanako. Upon completing the investigation, Mr. Kozai issued a statement. In this day and age, one must stay aware of even slight changes in the environment and react politically. Okay. Today, I talked with a young student who spoke her own mind, free from the influence of those around her. It was an attitude and an example that we as adults can learn from. Our primary concern should always be to protect these children's futures. On that note, Mr. Kozai ended his statement. The assembled parents applauded. But some raised concerns that it was a show to attract voters in the next election. The news continues. <gasps> oh, Nanako, do you want me to get you a blanket or something? My head hurts. Oh no. Nanako's face looks red. Shit. You gotta you probably have a cold. For some reason, colds are serious business. She has a high fever. You need to put her to bed. What? Gave medicine and had her lie down. Hey, big bro. What's up, Nanako? Are you going back home in spring? Tell you the truth, I haven't thought about it. It's going to be winter soon. Yeah. If it snows, can we make a snowman? Yes, Nanako, we can make a snowman. We can play a lot. Yes, we can. We will. Let's play all the time until spring. Sounds good. I agree to this, Nanako. Nanako seems to have fallen asleep. You should take her to bed later. Oh boy, huge rainy day. Ah! So, the cultural festival is over. Old Man Winter is on his way. Sure hope none of you are wimping out with hand warmers under your clothes. Today, I'll focus on building your immunity against colds. That way, you'll move on to next year in good health. Does anyone have here rest your chin on your hands? That's a sign that your muscles are weak. Let's see, I'll pick Mugen. Since you hang out with Yosuke, who does that all the time? Which muscles do you think are weakening when you tend to rest your chin on your hand? Isn't it your neck muscles? Cause it's like you're not holding, since you're not holding up your head. So it's uh, your neck to your arms? Incorrect. Uh, bad posture usually comes from your back. Come on, don't hunch over because it's cold. Stand up, oh wow, really? So resting your head on resting your head on your hands like reduces your back muscles. Now I have some special exercises for you. I'm the one who invented them. Ha ha! Everyone, form a circle. The answer was incorrect. Up yours. Lunch time. Soccer. 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 Chie! Oh! Yo! Mugen kun Um, I was thinking of going to train today. Yeah. Mm. Meet me after school then. Awkward much? Class is ended for today. Alright, Chie! Let's do this.
Central Shopping District in front of Chinese Daya Ida. Finish today's training and decide to stop by. All right. Today is staple day. Just you wait. Uh, I don't have any more. Don't tell me they're at it again. Let's go, Mugen. Oh, now they're picking on little kids? Hey. What are you up to? Huh? Aw, oh, not her again. Hey, I know how to handle this bitch. You look like you got something planned. Help. Hear that, Chie Chan? He wants help. How do you know my name? Ran right into that the guy you saved last time. He had a friendly conversation. Told us all kind of stuff. Like where you live, about that precious Yukiko son of yours. What are you trying to pull? Oh, I'm just gonna have a little chat with this kid. Stay put, okay? Cause who knows what'll happen to Yukiko san if you get her. Oh my god! Can I go punch this guy, Takashi? Huh, man, that's nasty. Why you? Sniff. Things aren't looking good. All right, so it's okay to rip these punks a new one? Sure about that? So you don't care what happens to your best friend? Fine, then hit me. You're pissed at me, right? Then why don't you take a, just take a swing at me? I won't fight back. Be my guest. To face the gut, just pick a target as hard as you want. Come on! Freak. What's with this bitch? She for real? Whatever, man, let's go. Miss, thank you. <laughs> oh no, don't worry about it. Child went off. My heart's still pounding. Is that stupid of me? You protected that kid. Uh, Thanks. <laughs> it might have been stupid, but I wanted to save them. That kid, Yukiko. I know that feeling wasn't fake. I really wanted to protect them. I feel our relationship has grown deeper. Alrighty, so we got one more level with Chie now. Is enhanced. You can now endure Moto Blue. Hmm. Um, well, you see. Well, I also want to protect you. you. Might be a little flaky, but maybe you don't even need protecting. But I, I want to protect you. The mood is right. However, you already, you are already in a relationship with another girl. What should you do? I'm counting on you. You can depend on me. So let's have some steak. Delicious. <laughs> that was pretty awesome. Oh, you're home. Hey, Nanako, how you feeling? I went shopping with Jerry the Fidge. How you feeling, Nanako? My head still hurts. Oh yeah. Dad said you got the best score in the school test. That's incredible. Oh, I made this. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Bead ring, I wonder what that does. Bead ring. Bead ring, oh, that's nice. Thanks, Nanako. Uh, today's Tuesday, so I don't think I have anything. Nope. Okay. Understanding. Go. I'll get this tutor job at the last minute. Huh? What's up? Hey, is she, do you have any plans for tomorrow? Why don't we go inside the TV? You know, training? 
Huh. I guess. First I gotta get my understanding up. Then we'll worry about training. So how to make cranes. Carefully folded. Ah, stupid understanding taking forever. Should I? Should I not? Should I? I don't know. Hey, Rize. Senpai. Morning. I had so much fun last week. There was the cultural festival, and then we had the sleepover with everyone. I was really happy. I thought I'd never be able to experience things like that anymore. Oh, did you see the weather report? Looks like it's going to start getting rough this weekend. We need to keep a close eye on the Midnight Channel. It hasn't rained lately, so we haven't been able to see it. We might be in for a surprise the next time it's on. Let's be careful. Yeah. Town seems to think that the case is closed, but the real killer hasn't been caught yet. Yes, I know. We proved that. Lunchtime? What is up? Soccer? Or Chie? Oh. You. Oh, it's you. You're not busy today, right? Hang out with me? Yeah. Alright, see you later. Huh. So many social links, so little time. We'll go train on like a rainy day. Cause then we can get um the rare shot we can get the rare shadows. In front of Okina Station. Came here because I insisted. Hmm, I don't really feel like buying stuff today. What should we do instead? Hmm. Let's just chill. What? Uh -huh. What do you mean you don't you mean you don't have any kind of plan? Sounds boring. Oh well, maybe we'll be able to make it interesting. You know, it's pretty fun. If I didn't sign up to manage your team, you wouldn't be here with me now. Looking at it from your perspective, I say you got pretty lucky. I appreciate it. <laughs> I guess you should be thanking me. It was your advisor who put me on your team. He said something like, I, being on a team should teach you something about putting someone besides yourself first. I don't understand people who play sports in the slightest. But I guess it wouldn't kill me to go cheer you on every once in a while. It smiles with self-importance for some reason. Seems she's begun to like you a little. This is like one of the weirdest relationships. One of them. Cut Jesus three. I guess towards the oh, hey um, I son, um, us meeting here like this, it must be fate, right? So um, you want to go out with me sometime? Ha! Huh, you kidding me? Have you looked in a mirror recently? Wow. Bitchy McBitchingtons. That was downright cruel. What makes you think you have any right to be mad at me? You know, at the very least, I've never judged you for who you are. I'm going home. Ah, uh, fuck! I don't have time. 
time to fix relationships. I just spoke my mind. That was downright cruel. How you feeling, Anako? <laughs> Today I I love you, big bro. All right. Well, I'm a save. That was bullshit. But that was downright cruel. The fact is that she's like, "Uh, no. Have you looked in a mirror recently? You're such a bitch." Ah! Uh! You know what? Whatever. I don't care if the fucking relationship, you know, no. Done. Done. Done with her. Now, nope. I'm going to focus on all my, all of my other social links. Screw you. Huh. Anyways, besides all of that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Otherwise, um, yeah, I'm going to end this session here. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this session. So, so much has happened. It is unbelievable how, how much shit has just happened. We had the cultural festival. We had staying at the Amagi Inn. We just reversed our first rela uh, reversed our first relationship. So, and you know what? She's a bitch. She needs to be told in her face that what she said was cruel. So, you know what? I'm water under a bridge. I'm not gonna worry about it. Like, even it pops up and says, "Yeah, reversed." Huh? Huh? <laughs> Your relationship with I isn't going very well. You know what? I don't give a shit anymore. You can be all pissed at me all you want, I. I don't give a shit. So, alrighty guys. So, I am Lady Renasaro. Thank you for watching. Um, from now on, I'm just going to focus on the rest of the social links. Because I feel they're more important than this, than bitchy McBitchingtons right now. So, alrighty. So, all right, guys. So I'll see you guys in the next session of Persona Four. So we're getting very close to the end. It's already November, so it's gonna be very interesting. So see ya.